Hello everyone. So we are still in quarantine, so I am trying to find a space <laughs> to do this video for you. Um, today we are going to do just some cardio boxing moves today. So what you're going to need is just a weight that you can hold. So you can use um, some plates like I am, or you can just use um, actual dumbbells. You can use wrist weights if you want to just use a wrist weight, or you can do this without weights. The weight is just going to give you an added burn. Um, so when when you've got your weights, make sure that you're not just going through the motions, okay? You're actually, as if you are actually fighting someone, you know, put in the work, put in the effort, don't just go through the motions, okay? If we're going, if we're just jabbing here, don't just jab, but actually jab, okay? All right, so what we're gonna do first is we're gonna start with some jabs, then we're gonna do some jab crosses, then we're gonna do some uppercuts. Um, just gonna kind of make sure of things adding in there. Everything is going to be one minute on 10 second rest for you guys. So when you start your timers, make sure it's one minute on 10 second rest. And then you're gonna do these two times through. All right, so the first one that you're gonna do is I'm gonna start on this side. Okay, you're just gonna do jabs all right you're just gonna keep jabbing for one whole minute all right then you'll switch sides and jab okay one whole minute picture yourself if you've got some anger going on something like that picture whatever it is that's making you angry and just go for it all right after we do that we're gonna do jab crosses all right go back to the other side you're gonna jab cross All right, when you cross, your back leg is gonna come out. Okay, you're gonna get that rotation in. Jab, rotate. All right, don't do this, you're gonna hurt yourself. Jab, rotate. Jab, rotate. Jab, rotate, all right? Same thing with the other side. Jab, rotate. So make sure you're rotating that leg and the body around. All of it working together all right after that what we're gonna do is we're gonna do some uppercuts all right so you're just gonna uppercut over and over other side uppercut over and over all right after that you're gonna do jab cross uppercut jump jab cross uppercut jump other side, jab, cross, uppercut, jump. All right, if, the, if it's too hard for you to just keep going through it, then you can take some breaks in between. Jab, cross, uppercut, jump. Jab, cross, uppercut, jump. Okay, it's gonna be a minute on. You're gonna feel the burn. All right, okay. So you're going to do that, and then after, you're going to do one, two, three, four, one, knee in. All right, one, two, three, four, one, knee in. All right, other side, one, two, three, four, knee in, okay? And when you bring that knee up, you're going to drive like you're taking that person's head, bashing him in, okay? One, two, three, four, bash, okay? After that, you go back, you're gonna do one, let's see, one, two, three, four, and then one, and then you're gonna step back, kick out, one, two, three, four, one, kick out. Okay, other side, one, two, three, four, up, step back, kick out. All right, 
then after that, I'm just gonna do straight uppercuts, okay? Over and over and over again, over and over. You're gonna keep doing that for one whole minute, all right? And then we're gonna end, put your weights down. We're just gonna end with some high knees, okay? And then you're done, all right? Just relaxing the body after everything that we did. That's gonna be your cardio for the day. You're gonna really, really feel it. The weights that I have are two and a halves. I could go to five. I usually use five, but with my brace on, I can't grip a five with the brace on. It gets in the way. So I would say two and a half to five pounds is good. You don't want heavy weight in this at all. You just want a little bit of an added weight, all right? Two rounds, after you've completed all those, go back, do them again for two rounds, all right? Okay, good luck, guys.